careful, you could break your leg in the desert. That's what the cache says. That's the title. And we're going for it right now. It's over there, 139 meters. Wish us luck. We're gonna take you on a whole lot of adventures on a mini cache tour. Yeah, let's go. Yeah, believe it or not, this is a subdivision. <laughs> if you look at the Google Maps or uh, the Garmin map, it actually shows you the grid pattern of where the, all the houses and streets are supposed to be. <laughs> yeah, and what did you say? Oh, let's build a house here. Yeah, let's build a house here. Yeah. Why? <laughs> To, we got it. That wasn't so hard. Yeah, that's one for my fizzy grid. Yeah, the log is full. So Where we are we going to put, put our a little name? CC right on the very right tip. Right there. Right there that's Cache us. Canada. There we go. I never would have thought it would be so cold. <laughs> We've been to Las Vegas area twice now, and both times there has been snow in the area. Uh, we came years ago to a NASCAR race, and there was snow on one end of the strip. Luckily not the end that we were at. And by the time we got to the race, it warmed up, thankfully. But we have yet to be here when it's warm. <laughs> and we're back. Getting close-ish, 22 meters to go. Hey, look at all the seed pods on the Joshua tree. Yeah, that's an interesting rock. It's got like, it's like concrete with pieces of steel bedded into it. That's really different. Oh, and it's heavy. Yeah, the sandstone is, is dissolving and the iron deposits are remaining. Yeah, yeah, you can see that. Keep your eyes peeled. Now on this one, uh, it says the desert is full of surprises. So, well, we'll see if we're surprised. It's looking like a, a likely cluster right there, or those fallen logs. Oh, I heard a beep, so we're close. What about those cluster of logs? What about that log that's sawn right there, right in the middle? Right there. Right there, is that it? Bada boom! Bada -boom. That's a good one. I'm going to give that a favorite point. Because that is a different kind of wood. That's a pine log next to a Joshua tree. If you're a geocacher, you can spot stuff like that where other people wouldn't give it a second look. Here, take that out. <laughs> Got it. You're right. That is definitely worth. Oh, yeah. A favor point. Yeah, we'll drop down two. Ready? There we go. Two favorite points on that one. Awesome well done. Cash, yeah. Love it. That was a surprise. It was. In the desert. It was a very good surprise in the desert. Can you see the people climbing on the rock down there? Way over there. They, they look so tiny. This one spot coming up is so amazing. It's like a red, a huge red band in the middle of the kind of the blondish rock. It's just 
odd. <laughs> Amazing spot here. It looks so spectacular. And we've got two earth caches, uh, two traditionals, and a reverse where I go here to get. And uh, hopefully we get enough time and they're close enough together that we can get them all. I'm just hoping. And we're so glad that you can come along with us. This is awesome, this little mini cache tour we've got going on. We hope you're enjoying it. This is the sandstone, sandstone, okay, this is the sandstone, I, sand, Say it five times I can't, fast. I can't, sandstone, 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 do, 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 do. sandstone quarry earth cache, and you have to measure the block behind us, which is right next to the sign, and, we're not telling, and do uh, answers which involve math, and uh, volume, and weight, so you have to figure out how much this thing weighs, and just over here is where the sandstone came from. Fortunately, it wasn't economical for them to quarry this stone so that we can enjoy it today. Otherwise, it would probably be gone. And it just, it looks, it's like, just so strange, it just amazes me, it's cool. <laughs> it's cold out now, <laughs> we're snowing. Yeah, feels like home. There's snowflakes falling down. Except there's mountains nearby. <laughs> And uh, we're off to see where Fred Flintstone worked. That's a traditional cache, about 150 meters just ahead of us. Okay. We're getting close. The geocache beeped. And I'm thinking it's down in that crack. Possibly. I'm thinking I see it. Oh, that's good news. <laughs> Not too far ahead. Oh, almost right where I thought it was. This is where Fred Flintstone worked. An ammo can in Red Rock Canyon. And it's red. <laughs> I found her. Right, uh, right there. Katie Howard, geocaching Katie. And Steve, 1988, her dad. Right there in the log from December 29th, 2015. I found it! What'd you find? The geocache! Ta-da! Inside the log book. Ooh, this is a big one. I'm gonna cover it up. Red foot snow. yep a dub a <laughs> Don't trust the rocks because they're slippery now. This next cache is 60 meters from here, up there. <laughs> it's a 2 4. We're not sure if we're going to be able to make it, we're going to try. We just got to scramble up into the rocks. Yeah, that big rock on the satellite image is creating a big shadow, and it's just to your left somewhere. In those bushes, we're close. Hold on, let me get my flashlight out. I was just about to say we couldn't find it because we're so close, and I asked Lyric Glass to go around the corner to see another way down. And just as I tur just about turned the camera on, she said she got it. <laughs> that one sure was an adventure, just to get up here, but. You could see on the satellite image a little channel between the rocks and then there were some footprints and you could go up and just climbing up here and then just just to get to the right spot. But we got it. This is a two, four in red rock. Here's your pen. My pen. It sure would be nice to go straight forward because I can see the parking lot in this, this cut between the two rocks but I'd have to be about 125 pounds lighter and thin as a rail to get through that. <laughs> back we go. Making our way back down. We were just concerned whether we'd lose our light, but so far it's so good. And uh, just get back down to the parking lot. And uh, maybe at where I go cash to finish off the day. Fred Flintstone, you wore me out. That was an awesome caching day. We've lost our light. We can't cache anymore. 
<laughs> Thank you so much for joining us on this mini cash tour once again. And uh, don't forget to like, share, subscribe. Yeah, and keep watching. There's more There's caches. More caches to be found. And where will geocaching take you? Where will geocaching take us? To the wedding chapel. To the wedding chapel. It's time to get a and geocache and to the chapel. Nobody there. There's a buzzer. Oh, you gotta reach out and get the I'm buzzer. Reach and get the buzzer. We're gonna buzz. We're gonna buzz the window. Okay, here we go. We buzzed. It's time to get remarried. All we want is the cash. There it is, right there. Okay. Well, I buzzed yeah. the buzz. Okay, you buzzed the buzz. She's so buzzed. We'll Someone will come. Somebody at the desk there. And then they're just maybe maybe the buzzer doesn't work. Can we just reach in the window and grab the cash? No. <laughs> no. <laughs> Oh, there's a bar on the window. Darn it all. Oh, how much does it cost? Oh, wow, there's prices. Wedding music. Drive up ceremony. wedding appetizer, breakfast. breakfast, wedding music ceremony, Dinner. rose presentation, fifty-five dollars. T-shirts, fifty. A license plate. Photo Ooh. package, a license dessert, kisses, hugs, and congratulations are included. Ooh, there's nobody coming. Bumper sticker, two bucks. I don't want a bumper sticker. Oh, darn it. Single rose, champagne flutes, a dollar. Three postcards, a buck. I don't want a postcard. Oh, she doesn't want a postcard. Oh, somebody's coming. Wedding ring, three nine thirty-nine dollars Some guy's coming. Okay, somebody's coming. Souvenir mugs. Oh, everybody Six see bucks. us now. Oh, they're coming. Hi there. Hi. Sorry. We came we're, for the geocache. We're, oh, we're happily married 30 years, so we don't need to be married. And you're on video. Is that okay? Hi. It's a geocaching video. Do you guys want to come inside and do it? Oh, uh, yeah, we'd sure, love it's a to. It's easier on you guys, not yeah. so cold. Yeah, yeah that's right, true. So if you guys just come back right here. Okay. Back around right there in the back alley, and then make a quick left. Yeah. parking right there. And we'll see you inside? inside. Yeah. Awesome. Okay, great. Right, we'll be right, right there. All right. All right. Hello. Hello. I have it set right over here on our table in our lounge awesome. here, okay? Thank you. Very you guys much. can just leave it there when you're done, okay? Okay, Thank you thanks. Very much. Look at this, a little spot. Look at the wedding frills. Wow. That's awesome. Guest book. Nice. Oh, and there's a garter. Ooh. Can I put it on? <laughs> patty cake was here. Who's that? I don't know. It just says patty cake. All right, here we go. Oh, somebody was here from Gatineau, Quebec. Oh, yeah? Yeah. Fellow Canadian. Twenty seventh, nineteen. Happy Thanksgiving to all of our American viewers, and uh, although you'll see this way past Thanksgiving, cool. We're in. Happy non-wedding, Mrs. Lear class. <laughs> Happy Thanksgiving. <laughs> Happy Thanksgiving. Uh, it was a cool cash. You had to get it, and had to do the drive-up window. Yeah, this is cool. This is cool. <laughs> yeah, this is neat. Awesome. Let's get another cash. Okay.